Man, I am thirsty. Hey, water. Oh, boy, this is going to feel good. Hey, don't drink that. Oh, dude, whoa. It's dirty. It's so dirty. It's gross. I'm gross. I can't drink that. Ew. You know what? This really does remind me of something. You know, sometimes we allow things into our lives that we that shouldn't really be there, like maybe friends or things on the, on the internet or books or even things at school and stuff that really don't need to be in our life, you know? And that they're destructive and they hurt us. And if you've trusted in Jesus as your savior, you know, God, he calls you to, to walk with him, to, to learn from him, right? And he gives you new desires, you know? You start seeing things in your life like, ah, like this. I don't need this. I don't need these things in my life. Well, as you begin to go to the Lord, as you spend time with him in his word, I want to show you something today. This is what ends up happening. You spend time with God in his word. You know, he's speaking to you. You're talking to him. You might even be spending time definitely with other believers and, and stuff like that. And God, what he ends up doing is those sinful things in your life, he begins to remove them by the word of God, right? And the more time you spend with him in his word, you can begin to see your life becomes cleaner and cleaner all by God's grace, right? Let's get that all in there. Look at that. And then you can see your life has begun to change. And he gives you new desire. I'm gonna drink this. Uh, yeah, I can drink that now. Because God makes your life all clean. You know, I wanna read this verse to you, which relates to this today. And it says this. Turn my eyes from looking at worthless things and give me life in your ways. Psalms 119.37. I want to encourage you guys to spend time in God's word. Maybe even Psalms 119. Read that whole passage and watch God change your life to be more clean and pure.